I don't know if that's too low. Is that too high? I'm in my boss's office. He's away on holidays. Um, just wanted to point out that my boss has this in his office. What in Jesus's name is that terrifying? What even is it? Oh my God. Oh my God, this is amazing. Uh, there we go. I love complaining and whinging. So this video is all about complaining and whinging, which is what I feel is a true reflection of who Christian Hull really is. So I just wanted to go through and list all the things that piss me off and make me angry. And at the top of the list, it says slow walkers. I recently uploaded a video to my Facebook page, which did really well because it turns out every mother goddamma in Australia hates slow walkers. Forget the elderly, they are slow walkers because they can't walk. I'm talking about people that meander on a footpath. Two people together meandering slowly. The footpath isn't big enough for the two of you and you're walking at a snail's pace. A move! You're taking up the entire footpath and I want you to piss off and move because I am on a mission. I need to get my lunch. I need to get back to work. I have stuff I want to do. Number two, I'm going to go to the ATM machine. No, you're not. You're going to go to the ATM. And this one. Lol, I'm sorry. Did you just laugh out loud? No, you didn't. You said lol, which is an acronym for laugh out loud. And you didn't laugh out loud. So don't say lol and don't say acronyms. Acronyms are to be written in text messages. They're not to be said. I don't say I'm going to the atom, do I? I say I'm going to the ATM. Oh, no, I do use an acronym. Anyway, don't say lol. Just don't do it. Just don't do it. Number three, people who eat loudly. I don't want to hear you eat, so don't eat loudly. Number four, impatient drivers. Where in God's name are you going that you need to be there yesterday? My last video was me driving for the first time in 18 months and I was terrified. I was approaching a roundabout, I was going slow and then suddenly some guy tooted me because I was going too slow. Well, you know what, you big fat jerk? I wasn't, I was terrified, leave me alone. I then pulled up and I cried. I didn't want to drive anymore. Number 70. Ah, oh, being social. What an absolute drain. Now I have great friends, right? And I communicate with them very minimally. Not because I don't like them, because being social is so goddamn difficult. God, on reflection, that sounds really mean. Number potato. Deathly afraid of balloons. I cry when there's a balloon anywhere in the vicinity. I hate them. Number 600. When someone gets a phone call and their phone is on like loud, when you can hear it, and they don't answer it, they carry on working and their phone is just ringing. Irene is a huge culprit of that. She works in our office. She's divine. I love her. But she's the only one in the office. Right? She'll get a phone call and she'll look at her phone and it'll be like, dang, 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 dang. It's ringing. Like, it's just ringing. Dang, 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 dang. I'm like, oh my god, what the hell is that noise? And I'll look over and Irene is just there. Phone's going ballistic. I'm like, Irene, there's a button on your phone where you can hit and it silences the phone. Would you please push it? And she'll also set an alarm because um, in the car park, um, you have to move your car every so often, otherwise you'll get a fine. So she'll set an alarm, but she'll be like making a tea. She'll have gone. And her phone is just going, meh, meh, meh. Meh, meh. And then she'll hear it, she'll be like, oh God, is that me? And I'm like, Irene, it is only ever you. It is no one else. Everyone has their phone on silent. Every human being leaves their phone on silent because they don't want to be that person. They don't want to be Irene. But see, the thing about Irene is I don't want her to ever fix that problem because now we just piss ourselves laughing at how funny it is that she'll just be there and her phone will just be going absolutely mental and she will be so oblivious. Hello, I'm Alfred the Fox. Oh my sweet Lord of Jesus. 
when you're lining up for food and you get to the front of the line in a food court and it says cash only and you don't have any cash. In what era do we live in? If you can pay with your retina, like cash only, we are soon going to forego any cash. Your business needs to stop being dodgy and get a goddamn FPOS machine. You can get a machine that plugs into your phone and I can tap my card on your phone and pay. I want my goddamn dumplings. I have so many more things I want to add, but this video has gone on for so long. If I have missed anything that you want to add to that list, you tell me. You put it in the comments and I will make a part two of this video because I am a bitter, angry human who loves to whinge. Please subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Christian Hull in my boss's office. Please subscribe to Christian's channel. Mwah, mwah, mwah.